Well, hey guys, and welcome back to yet another review on my channel. Today, we're going to be taking a look at the Aurora Miniature 6276 CF Plate F box cars. I have IC21090 and FBOX 506913. These models are priced at $70 MSRP, but as you can see from Lombard Hobbies, I got it for $53, and this one I also got from Lombard Hobbies. Um, I managed to get the last one of these, but we're gonna be taking a look at these next. Let's let's get to the unboxing. All right, so because I just got this model and it's the newest of the two, we're gonna be taking a look at the Illinois Central car. The unboxing is very simple. And you guys wanna know something interesting? There's no paperwork. So you can find all paperwork for all these cars on their website, which I'm pretty sure it says it on here somewhere. And there's their socials. Um, we've never taken a look at an Aurora Miniatures car before, so I guess I'll show you the box. You can see there. Made in China. They're out of Toronto, Ontario, Canada. So, box in. Pretty simple. Clamshell packaging. We've seen that with all kinds of companies. Pull off the soft plastic that protects the paint. And there's the model. And we'll just put all that to the side. Here's the car. We'll take a closer look at this next. All right, well, taking a closer look at the model, I just wanted to state really fast that the couplers, I have checked those on the F-Box model or TTX, as you can see here. I've checked them on this model and they were in gauge. I don't have a coupler height gauge as of the, this time, so we're just gonna have to go off of those. Those were engaged, so hopefully these are. But once again, taking a closer look at the model, We'll start on the B end of the car. You can see the coupler cut lever, stirrups, uh, separately applied ladders. Um, you got the brake wheel there. Pretty sure the walkways are see-through. Yep, yep. They have their own brand couplers. I'm pretty sure they're metal. They're, they're the most scale coupler I've ever seen. And they don't. Have, you can't see the spring. It's covered up. You can see all the lettering on the car. Um, right here it says, Excess height car, meaning that's a taller car. Right here it says IC, and the car number, which is uh, 21090. Oh, and by the way, the uh, it's got silver tipped air airlines there. I don't even know if you guys can see it, but it does have the spinning roller bearing caps. We'll take a look at that later. But we can see the details on the door. Look at those those wall panels there now apparently the door is removable i haven't tried it yet i tried it on the, the uh, ttx car but i couldn't get it off and i was a little too nervous to keep going so we won't be taking a look at that feature today there's the uh, a end of the car and it's the same on this side um we'll take a look at the ttx car next but before I w before we do that i do want to take a closer look at the uh the trucks, they do spin. Uh, the underside, this part right here I had to glue back on. And then I had to apply some glue for the uh, the trucks there, because that kept falling off. But besides that, everything else is, is good, and they, uh, they roll super well. So we'll, we'll take a look at the TTX car. All right, so right here we have the TTX car. And that just looks really nice, beautiful yellow. We all love these yellow cars. Um, can't go anywhere without seeing them. So those, it's really nice. The underbody is the same as the other one. I'm, I'm pretty sure they have the same underbody. Yeah, they seem to have the same underbody. I don't know if they have the same roof type. Um, they look to have the same roof type, so. Yep, there are both of the cars. We will do a roll test and then a run by. And uh, yeah. All right, so I decided to put both of them on the track here. And as you can see, they look to be the same. The IC might be a tad bit lower on the couple of heights, but they look to be the same height. Um, I will do a roll test here. Try and see if we can get you guys a angle there. As you can see, two cars. They look to be running pretty fine. So we're going to flip this car around. So 
We can show off that nice brake detail. And uh, we'll put on the EJ&E Heritage. And we'll get you guys a run by. Oh, next.